routes that take more time, you might be able to chip with him with the running back. Gonna go for it right here, deep down the field for Brown to make the catch. The man-to-man -man coverage, the one-on-one -on -one ends up out here. This has been there before. Brown is one-on-one. -on -one. He goes vertical. And the young quarterback finally finds him. And that's a critical PAT because it makes it a three-point game. Jaden Oberchrome with the extra points. And typically, Texas Tech likes to keep help in the middle of the field. And so you get one-on-one -on -one outside after the rotation. So if you just run a good route, the safety is nowhere to be found. Those plays have been there before. Boykin just hasn't thrown the ball accurately down the field. Different story on that play to Brown. Well, he had the time. Bush was blocked. And they managed that time kind to block him without chipping him. They, that time the tackle did his job yeah, and, and right. kept him in. They, I thought they were going to chip with the running back, but he went out of the pattern. So 2.25 to go. Remember, the timeout situation for Texas Tech, of course, they're the team with the lead. They don't want to stop the block. They can't. TCU has two timeouts left. What a beautiful hookup by, by Brown and by Boykin on that play. Two freshmen. Now, TCU, considering an onside kick here, I am sure, Texas Tech.